Dr. Kizi Shako. I'm also a medical doctor. I work for the Ministry of Health in the Forensic and Pathology Services Department. I attend to victims of violence or to the living injured. I deal with a lot of victims of domestic violence, mostly women, um, child abuse, child sexual assault and rape. So when a person is sexually violated and they've already received their medical treatment, their you know, medical intervention has been done, they've been analyzed and things documented on our post-rape care form, they then come to the police surgery to have the P3 form filled where we examine again and fill out our findings on a P3 form, which will then be used by the court. Because I see up to like six defiled children a day, about 15 victims of domestic violence every day. So I decided to start writing about it because it was, you know, it's like I have to do something. So I tried talking to a few media personalities that didn't work out and I decided to just blog about it. So far there's been very positive response. I get a lot of messages, especially on um, social media. People call me, very many people consult me to ask, you know, what should I do here? What should I do now? Some of the challenges I face are um, Dealing with first personnel who don't really understand the, the crucial, you know, imp the importance of indicating documentation properly and the right way. Once in a while you get officers telling you that, hey, we secured a conviction and that it's the best thing you can ever hear. The Zuri Award uh, strengthens my resolve to continue the work that I'm doing. When you work in a field that you're passionate about, you will succeed because you have what it takes, you have the drive and the passion to push through and climb over all the obstacles.